Hi, I'm Julie Jackson, Communications Coordinator for the City of Collinsville. We're out at another one of our monthly electronics recycling events. These events are free and they're held the second Friday of each month from 12 noon until 6 p.m. The truck shows up at the public parking lot across the street from Spurito's Italian Market and next to Computer Ease on Main Street. These do run the second Friday from now up until the end of the year in December. All of the proceeds that are raised from these recycling events go to the Miners Institute Foundation. Now all that money will go to the restoration and reopening of Miners Theater. We basically take anything from the battery that powers your remote all the way up to large appliances. Uh, the only items we no longer accept are the older style, so the bigger back televisions. If they're flat screen televisions, such as you know something like this, that's fine, that's an acceptable item. But the bigger style televisions we no longer accept. And the reason for that is because you can no longer charge a residential consumer in the state of Illinois. There's actually two locations in the Metro East. One would be Best Buy in Fairview Heights. You can take up to three items, up to 27 inches or smaller there per day. Or you can go up to Goodwill and Belleville. Goodwill and Belleville is the only Goodwill in the Metro East that accepts them because of the hub for St. Louis. They'll accept up to two per day, any size, working or non-working condition. So with the monitors, I'll accept one monitor with every computer tower that you drop off because that helps my company offset the cost of the proper recycling of this. But like I said, any flat screen technology is just fine. Digital cameras, wires, um, any wires that powers any kind of device is fine. Speakers, um, everything from diabetic testers. Anything that is powered by a battery or cord is an acceptable item, like I said, with the exception of the televisions. There's times when we get here at noon and I, people are already waiting for us to just set up so they can drop off their item. Again, they go from noon to 6 p.m. and all the money that the, that the company, We Cycle Belleville, raises from these electronics recycling events goes to the Miners Institute Foundation. Now, all of that money will then in turn go to the restoration and reopening of Miners Theater. If you have questions about items to recycle or would like more information, you can visit wecycle-belleville.com.